Guten Abend, a Frau und Mädchen from Florida. Um, everything that I need to do down here is uh, done. So I have the next three days uh, free. If uh, anybody wants to uh, meet up, I don't like driving. So it'd have to be local. Um, I already flew a thousand miles down here. Um, when I get uh, back, which will be on Thursday, I uh, will start reviewing within the next seven days the new XT30. That's uh, when my uh, XT30 uh, comes in. I didn't want it uh, sent to me for me to order it until I got back. Um, so the XT30, continue working on the free booklet on uh, Fujifilm tricks and tips. I said bo it's booklet, but I mean, it's going to be about 50 pages long, and it's going to be more than one edition. But even the first edition should be somewhere around 50 to 55 pages. I uh, should absolutely have it done by the end of April. I've been going full blast on the book, and yes, it's uh, completely free. Um... I find it odd that some of these uh, YouTuber idiots, um, not workshops, but like meetups, <laughs> some of these people are like, <laughs> it's like, meet up with YouTuber so-and-so for three days for a thousand dollars. It's like, really? It's like, come hang out with me, you know? And the privilege of that is a thousand dollars. You know, <laughs> how about we just like meet for free and discuss photography and actually go out and shoot for free. Um, none of those people were none of those people's advice is actually worth anything. But they want to charge you a thousand dollars not to teach me. They just just hang out with me, yeah, for the next three days upcoming next month. Uh, that'll be a thousand dollars, please. The arrogance, you know. The secret of me, not that anybody wants to know that, is that. I'm actually not mean at all. I just have a low tolerance for BS. I do. I have a low tolerance for BS. I've seen way too much crap in this life. Way too much crap. I just have a low tolerance for BS. That doesn't make me mean. The people you shouldn't trust are the people that are always trying to kiss your ass and blow smoke up your skirt. Or in the case of Scotland, up your kilt. <laughs> Those are the people you don't trust. Um, um, it's the most evil people in the world to splash on some cologne and uh, throw on a three-piece suit and spend the entire day trying to figure out ways to screw good people over. Um, yeah, I would like meet up for free this uh, Monday or Tuesday. I gotta fly back on Wednesday. So, I'm tired actually. I'm exhausted. I've actually been walking my ass off today. I had some free time, so I walked up and down the beach. You see I got a lot of sun. I think I like walked about three or three and a half miles on the beach today. I only got bit by uh, sand fleas and mosquitoes a couple hundred times, but that's okay. And someone will say, why didn't you spray some cancer-causing chemicals on you to, to keep the mosquitoes away? I think you just answered your question on that one. Yeah, yeah. This is, this is my palatial estate. Yeah, this is the pressure washer. It's like, what's that? That's a pressure washer. This is my palatial estate in Florida. Yay, two bedroom, two bath. Yeah, it sure is a luxury place. It's plenty fine enough for me. So yeah, now I'm rambling on at two o'clock in the morning. Yeah, I definitely am. Oh well. I wonder sometimes, you know, out loud to myself, I'm like, you know, what is it the hell that I get so much flack for? You know, I'm not out to screw anybody over and I'm not selling anything. And like, when I go somewhere, it's like, hey, would you like to meet up for free and like have some coffee and go do some photography? Holy shit, did you see that shit? Did you see that? Did you see that giant lizard? He's <laughs> jumping, welcome to Florida. Did you see that? I was like, what the F is behind me? Oh, it's a giant gecko. It's not a lizard. It's a gecko, which is technically a lizard. Yeah. Geckos like to make their way in through the air conditioning ducts, and then they wander around the house. 
Sometimes you'll wake up in the middle of the night, they'll like go use the bathroom, and then the geckos will be like staring at you from the walls and then be giving you the evil eye and they're looking at you like, hey, this is my place, bitch. What are you doing here? <laughs> that's what the lizards, you know, that's what I, I subconsciously think they're saying. No, I'm not crazy. That's just, they'd give you that stare like that. <laughs> I was like, what the hell is pounding on the wall behind me? Welcome to Florida. Jesus Christ. Invasion of the geckos. This place is infested with geckos. Somebody's like, ah, that's good for you to eat the insects. Yeah, but they're always thumping up, a, uh, thumping up the sides of the wall. They don't actually walk up the walls like lizards do. Geckos thump their feet. Little bastard geckos. Peace out, Girl Scout.